every staff member is given the opportunity to participate in the development of a product or a service. So we actually insist on every employee every week or every month depending on their role. They come to us with two or three new ideas, two or three new concepts they've, they've read about, uh, maybe a thought they've, they've had with a, after talking to a customer. They have to come to us with two or three thoughts every month or week about what, what else we could be doing out there. Um, in addition, of course, we're always uh, super connected to all the blogs and all the mobile applications out there that are constantly feeding information down to us. So the bigger, the bigger issue is trying to keep it all straight and figure out where to focus first. The first thing we have to do is we have to determine can we create a profitable product or service out of this idea and the second thing of course is do, do, does the customer really want it so if customers aren't willing to buy what we're developing there's not really much sense in, in going for it so if we can develop what we've learned into a sellable or packageable service or product that has a decent price to it and we, we test that out with clients and if they actually like it and buy it then we roll it out to more clients First of all, care about what your customers think and talk to them a lot and ask them, you know, don't be too proud to uh, ask questions and maybe look like you don't know everything because you don't. Um, don't be afraid to say, hey, I don't, I don't know that. I'm going to go back and research that. Or don't be afraid to ask them, what do you think? What have you seen? You may not look like an innovator by asking a customer something that you ought to know already, but you actually are because you're out there listening, you're out there filtering, you're getting information in from as many sources as you can.